we have such a dull face. <laughs> like, it's expressionless. Yeah, we're emotionless. Ooh. Yeah, it is a kimono. Like, oh, wait, you see something? No, don't you see the outfit she has on? No, I, I, I'm on Iki panting. Wait, what? Iki's like, hmm, ha, ha. Is it Did different? I skip something? Go back to the. Oh, yeah, my bad. <laughs> I was like, what? Yeah. I went to the wrong one. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, oh. Now I see the beautiful pictures and we finally see Iki's shoes. Yeah. How laces? His boots are... He's got like a knee-high boot. That are attached to his pants. It's weird. Oh, wait. It might be the, the pants then under it, under the things is the shoe. Ah, who knows? Yeah. Uh, oh, I can see it. It's, huh? It's pretty nice from here. This is surprisingly a good spot. It's a lot better than dealing with the crowds of people. And we can be alone here, too. Maybe we should just sit here and watch. Um, you're a little too close. Could you let go of my hand? What? You're squishing me. <laughs> um... Oh, and we see his pants too. He has plaid. He has shorts at the top and like. He's wearing like two pairs of pants. Two different patterns. I think that's the ins. Wait, wait, no. I think it's like. Above his knee is like part of the shirt, then that's the pants, then. It's a weird outfit. It's like cut and sewn together somehow. It's impractical, but <laughs> um, you're a little close. That's the better answer. That's the, that's the um, lesser evil. Yeah. You're a little close, Blush. Oh? I was thinking kind of holding back. Normally I'd let, put my arm around you at the very least. And I'd be willing to do anything as long as you allowed it. We're alone after all. I'm sure nobody would even think to look at the top of this building while fireworks are being launched. Hmm? Why are you being so wary? <laughs> it's a little too late now. If you wanted to die me, you should have done it before we were alone in such a dark place. Ha <laughs> ha! But if you really don't like it, you can say hello to Mr. Stabby Stab. <laughs> if you don't like holding hands or sitting next to me, you could let go now and run away. I'm trying to hold on to my self control here. I don't intend to do anything to you, but I can't make any promises. Although, I still wouldn't do anything. No. I just, I just noticed we have the exact same eyes as Orion. Do we? Yeah, the blue oh, horseshoe, then the pink eyes. Yeah. Are we twins? This is like a uh, recurring... Um, I don't see these eyes with Icky. I'm sorry, Icky? Like, he doesn't have the horseshoe eyes. It's only Orion, Shin, and Mine. Yeah. It's crazy. Um, where are we? Although I was still wouldn't do anything, I don't want you to dislike me. And this is already strangely satisfying. I wonder why. All we're doing is sitting down next to each other like this. Hmm? But how should I put it? I think I'm just really happy to be around your sense. Are you a demon? I'm trying to think of where's that from? Is that something else? I, I was thinking of Inuyasha. That was go about your scent. I don't remember that about him. But, well, all the other demons, like, you smell like a filthy human every time they meet up to, oh, yeah. to me. I'm, I'm really out of it. It's like I could barely remember the fox child, <laughs> and now I'm trying to remember everything about Inuyasha. Inuyasha was one of those shows that was like, hey, every now and then it's on TV, and maybe watch it. Anyways. Um, wait, how do you go back? Oh, see. Oh. Actually, no, I've been using the mouse scroll to see um, the lines. Your hand is soft, oh. too. It's really warm now oh, since we ran here. Your shoulder against mine. It kind of tickles. Everything about this is just unexpectedly satisfying. It's not bad at all. At least for now. I'd be lying if I had said I'd be satisfied with this forever and ever and ever. 
As he brings out like a pair of handcuffs and brings <laughs> you into his basement. Uh if if you know if you saw the anime that would have been uh Yes. Anyways, Iki, I won't spoil anything for you. What about you? Since you haven't run away ran away, and I assume you like it too. I feel like he might explode at one point. No, I think he's a calm person. No, I feel like he's gonna lose it at one point. He just seems like a sad, lonely person that you have to love. Like, I feel like he's gonna- we're not gonna be enough to him, and he's gonna freak out. He's like, he's gonna go full Yendari. Yendari, whatever. But we're the only girl in the world that doesn't love him for his eyes. He's definitely gonna go full Yendari, isn't he? I don't know. You're denying it. It must be true. I don't know. What about you? Have you haven't run away? Can I assume you want to get to? And what next? Will you not let let me kiss you yet? Oh, you nervous? Your hand is shaking a bit. Hey, could you say something? I'm giving up on you. <laughs> I'm afraid to go further. Fireworks are pretty. The fireworks are pretty. That's what we are talking about. <laughs> Let's be honest. I'm afraid okay. to go further. Afraid to go further. I, I kind of want to save just in case, though. I'm paranoid um, now. Our affection went up. I did? Yeah. Afraid to go further. You're afraid, huh? I see. Huh. I don't know whether I should be happy or you feel tension around me. Or if I should be sad that you're afraid of me. But, I guess that means we can't go on to the next stage yet. You cold? You could come closer. We could cuddle. Ellipses. Ah. Uh, looks like the fireworks are about to end. I wish they'd just keep going. Forever. Well, it doesn't matter. really matter anymore. I can see you tomorrow, too. And the day after that. And the day after that. And the day after that. As long as you are handcuffed to the radiator in my basement. <laughs> we still got 20 days. Okay. You have 7 days left to live. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, before we go on, have you played Yandere Simulator? Or heard of it? I've heard of it. Did not play it. That's the one where you... Like, I feel just... like it would be... Like, that game's too well anime for me, but I feel like you might like it. No, I don't like killing people. Eh. Ah, who knows? You never do. You never like it until you try it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ah, who knows? That's. I'm sorry about today. Is having to watch the fireworks from a place like this? I'll try to do something about those girls. Anyway, I guess I'll see you tomorrow at work. I'll kill them. Exclamation mark. <laughs> Rika? Rika, you're still here? Yes, I was here all along. <laughs> I just wanted to see your face one more time. She probably didn't go through the door with those knockers of hers. Like she got stuck. <laughs> I think Minnie's chest is bigger than hers. It doesn't look like that. Maybe it's because she exposes too much. Yeah. She's making up for other stuff. It seems you still ended up watching the fireworks with her. With her. Oh, yeah. We didn't go far, though. Rika, you live in the same direction, right? Should I walk you back? Oh. A Serenayiki. <laughs> Is that really okay? Be more than happy, as long as she she says it's fine. Go right ahead. Mm -hmm. I actually wouldn't like that. Um, go right ahead. Actually, I don't know. If I wouldn't like that, go right ahead sounds like um. I feel like the, the go right ahead would be a trust. It could either be a trust up and an affection and down, or I wouldn't like that would be a um. Would be a trust down and a maybe affection up. But. I would say go right ahead, to be honest. Like, I'm thinking yeah. too much into it. Yeah, because of the fangirls, 
your I think the goal is to please both everyone, so go right ahead. Yeah, yeah nothing happened really. Okay. My how generous. Then perhaps I'll take you up on that offer. Anyway, let's go, Rika. Oh, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Have a good night. Please let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't she seem super scary and evil? She's, a, she's another character that's like, I'm not sure what's your deal. <laughs> Welcome home. I'm sad. I thought I'd just be intruding, so I read the mood earlier and decided to disappear for a while. <laughs> but now I'm back. But still, that girl Rika seems pretty dangerous. She's a bit. She's a bit. <laughs> She's a bit. Not only does she look ridiculous. <laughs> Thank you for yeah, pointing out her clothes. That. She talks and acts like she's better than everybody. She's definitely the ringleader of that gang. <laughs> she's definitely French. It's no longer a fangirl club, it's a gang now. Oh wait, she's the head of that club? This is a new number. Huh? You have a call from an unknown number. I wonder who it is. Who do you think it is? Um, I bet it's the manager. The manager never calls us. Remember we got that text from that one unknown person to give us an update report? It's gonna be the manager. Yeah. Well, you don't have any numbers besides Ikis in the cafes. So it wouldn't be strange to get calls from unknown numbers right now. So, do you want to answer it? Yes. Ah, uh, see? Uh, um, it's it's Rika. Rika. Also, that music change. <laughs> yeah. I never heard this song before in Shinra. Huh. I'm trying to think of, is that a guitar? It sounds like a horror movie song. Do you honestly believe that Iggy belongs here? Um, have you seen that? It's like the it's the Blue Man Group or whatever. Like you know, they play the like garage things, like Iron Barrels and whatnot. Oh yeah. <laughs> it sounds like that kind of thing. Yeah. I like this music. It's awesome. Ah, it's a scary phone call. <laughs> <laughs> We'd like it. <laughs> We'd like it if you didn't get so carried away with yourself. Yeah, that's definitely the fan club. It's someone from the fan club. They hung up! Oh, I wish I would've given them girl number three voice. I could've... Wow. To be honest, we didn't even know what, who it was. Hmm. Well, it was definitely a girl. That's all we know. <laughs> what a scary <Yep>. call! <laughs> Unless it was shit. <laughs> Just imagine he's a part of the fan club, too. It's super effective! Just like Pokemon. Up. Oh. Flashback, Rika. But, just because you're going out with him, don't think he belongs to you. She gets even scarier. If you forget that, you die. Up, oh, she went <laughs> slender on us. Yep. Oh, wah! Wah! <laughs> wah! What's that? A memory of the past? <gasps> Okay, from here on out, every time you do wa with Orion, I will do that Waluigi wa. Wa! <laughs> but it was actually in the text this time for once. Yeah. It was awesome. <laughs> if it's in the text, I'll do it. Okay. Did that girl tell you something similar before? <laughs> that look. Ah, my head's spinning. Are you okay? That girl was crazy scary. We're like just crazy. She's like some kind of ghost demon girl. <laughs> like, you'd probably find her sitting under a weeping willow full of grudges t towards all of Iki's best girlfriends. Wow. Mm. She's the grudge. For now, you should record that number as demon girl and block all incoming communication from her. So it was just Rika, so. Yeah. Anyway, you should sleep for today. You're probably super tired. Even though all you did was sit on the roof and watch fireworks. Good night. I hope some better memories come back to you next time. And Orion jinxed us. Oh, that music. Rika. Ah, too scary. Too scary for so me. So scary, I closed the game. 
Nah. August 11th. That was a long day. Yeah, some days are really short and some are longer. But, well, that was a two-part day because we had the fireworks. Yeah. Do you, do you have a more? Oh, boy. It's you go! Oh, boy. Do it's time to give it the Christopher Walken voice. You don't mean to seem to do... Ah, you <laughs> seem to be well. It's nice to meet you, oh. Or should I say, it's been a while. Ellipses. What? I'm glad you're safe. You remember me? Up he, you he, go. He has Orion's eyes too. Does he? Yeah, mm, blue horseshoe. Slightly, he, it's real hard to see. Yeah, because he's like squinting. Um, Yuko, don't you remember me? Remember we when I killed your brother? <laughs> I sound just like this. No, that now I'm going into um that's <laughs> that's the um Ken's voice. Back of the voice. Um well You said You said That's Orion. It's nice to meet you. But why are you asking me if she remembers? That's Orion. <laughs> oh <laughs> I was like wait. wait. Sorry. Crazy. But I'll just tell you this now, you're gonna have to give Yukio two different voices. Oh. Um uh, Okay. So, this one's fine for now, but think of a scarier, meaner one for later. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try. Yeah. You said, it's nice to meet you. Why are you asking if she reminds you? Remembers you? Yeah. <laughs> Not only did you act like this, it was the first time you met, you also knew her name. That's creepy. Oh, this is a female? I'll give her a Christopher Walken voice? No, it's a guy. Oh. Her, but... <laughs> it's a guy. Orion doesn't know. He thought Oreo was a girl too. Oreo can't tell the difference, he's 12. It seems you don't remember me from the looks of it. To tell the truth, we met before in a different place. In a different world. But I doubt you remember anything about it. That's unfortunate. I suppose this is both a nice to meet you and a it's a burn while. That's all there is to it. Oh, damn it! I just remembered. I can actually do a GFK impression. You can? Sort of. But I need to practice it. Well, uh, pra I will be next recording, but yeah. I can actually do a GFK impression. Okay. It's just been a while. Uh, this is kind of hard to believe, but I guess it makes sense. But what kind of situation could this be? Did he see you somewhere and fall in love at first sight? <gasps> Maybe you met him when you were a kid, so there's no reason you, for you to remember? Oh, sorry, my bar. <laughs> I come by once in a while, and I'd be happy to talk to you. Talk to me a little when you do, when I do. Woods! Ellipses! Mm. What's up with the weather here? By the way, where are you going? Are you going out with anyone right I remember that. He's asked me that exactly in the a anime. Shin? Iki? Toma? Or maybe even Gent? Which world are we in? Dun dun dun. Wait, does this guy know people like Shin and Iki too? And who the heck is Toma? <laughs> so we never met Toma. Yeah. <laughs> How will you respond? I'm going out with Iki. Why do you ask? Um, uh, I'm going out with Iki. Yeah. We already know why. <laughs> ah, Iggy. I see. I wonder if that did anything. You got to be troublesome. Be careful not to be resented too much by others. Huh? I just have a hunch. If you can, watch out for the people around you. That's all I can say. I'm sorry for taking your time. You can go back to work now. What does this guy know? Why would he have a hunch? Can you see so, the future? So he's the like um, he's the um like mm, like the the all knowing crea character or I don't know. Yeah, the all knowing. Yeah. So he's like the um creator's um avatar, pretty much. Uh, well, he's deeply engraved to the story, and everything will make more sense once. You date him, that's why you have to date him last. He's like the last piece of the puzzle. Ah, so he's the Joker. Yeah. And that's why you need two do voices for him, because he's the Joker. <laughs> oh, you could could give the second voice a Joker, if you could. Unless it would sound too much like Hint. Oh well. 
I'll try. I'll do a Joker voice. Mm. Of course, you'd be wary about him if he doesn't explain it. What do you know? Are you with Rick and others? The uh, what cult? do you know? Yeah, what do you know? It's not part of an all-girl group. I'm sure you're curious. But I can't tell you now. I doubt you would believe me, even if I did. Anyway, that's all I can say for now. See you, and be careful. Really. Goodbye. Is it really that close to the Ken voice? Um... No, not that voice, but I'm saying, uh, the Joker voice might be close to the Ken voice. If you do ever do a jo Joker impression. impression. I, might I might give Ken back, uh, the JFK voice. But well, it depends. I don't need to practice again with it. Hmm. And let's see. What was with him? I don't get it at all. I wonder if he knows things about you that we don't know yet. <gasps> also, how many characters are there so I could know, like, I can stockpile some voices? Um... I think we met everyone except for Toma. Then there's side characters that only show up for like one scene. Yeah. Yeah, but I'll I'll do Toma's voice. <laughs> and then there's girl number voices. three. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, but at least he thinks you don't remember him. You don't have to try to hide your amnesia from him. He probably knows all about it. Mm -hmm. He seems to know you. If things go well, you might be able to get some information out of him. Yeah, he is kind of weird. But you should try talking to him if you two ever meet again. Oh! What's wrong? What's wrong? You alright? It looks like you were just talking to a customer right now. Why what did... happened? Now everyone looks like they have the same eyes now. Did, did it change suddenly? Now he has horseshoe eyes too. No, I think what's going on is because the guys have squintier eyes that we, we didn't really see it at first still weird. I feel like everyone's related and all of this is incest now. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Iki. Right. Maybe you should talk to Iki about what that guy said. Just that I was writing about my fanfiction about him. <laughs> I mean, nothing. What's the matter? Did he say anything weird to you? I think he knew me. He told me to watch out for resentful people. Resentful people. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Checking parameters. Um, everything is fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Yeah. About the same. Ellipses? Who was that guy? I wanted to go ask him some questions. Wait, you're going to a go ask? You're working! Eh, they don't care. He, he really did. Really <laughs> right on the floor. Well, at least he's a guy who can act when he thinks his girlfriend is in danger. I see. That's why we love him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> damn it. <laughs>